have many friends that are Muslims, and I will tell you, they are so happy that I did this because they know they have a problem. Hi everyone, my name is Emmanuel Shah from CalTV News. I'm standing here with Fatima Aneta from the Muslim Student Association at UC Berkeley. So tell me a little bit about what went down yesterday on Sproul and what message you were putting out by organizing what you did. Seeing all the protesters at the airports mm -hmm. and we really wanted to do something ourselves, we thought of having a prayer on campus where Muslims could come and pray and then non-Muslims could come and show their support. It would also send a message that we're here, we're unafraid, and we're unapologetically Muslim. What mm -hmm. do you guys intend to do after this? Continue to raise our voice and fight not just for Muslims, but for any other community or minority that may feel threatened by this administration. Just keep working and getting people motivated to um, go out and do some activism. I had a meeting with uh, somebody at the international office this morning who informed me that three students are not able to get back into the country after this weekend. Um, one student has decided to not come back at all. Um, I was just wondering how both of you feel about that and what you think the school should do or what we could do as a student body. I think students should continue being vocal and push the administration mm -hmm. um, to actually help out those students and offer services. Mm -hmm.